Guys, Southeast Softwash kicking off the week Monday. Uh, we're only about a half mile from my house and we get a lot of local calls for small stuff like this. Brick house, so brick usually stays fairly clean. It, it doesn't get terrible looking, uh, but we got a call to come out and clean these overhangs, the soffit, the facial boards here. Uh, and in our area, most people do have their facial boards wrapped in aluminum and then you've got the vinyl soffit under there. So if, if you can see, you'll come in here and try to, the sun's kind of bright above that, so phone's having a hard time adjusting. But you can see all this, it's just really dark. It's not supposed to look like that. It's a lot of organic growth. Over here's really bad. All this is just all the way around the house. So simple, one story ranch, easy to do. We'll be out of here in less than 30 minutes. Uh, and we've already done a section down here. I just did about a 10 foot section right here to the left of this window. So I'm, I'm pretty sure that's gonna show up in camera fairly well. So you can see the difference. It's gonna look like brand new when we get done. And soft washing is the way to go for this kind of stuff. Uh, so we'll, let me demonstrate real quick. Soft wash one, the truck's in the background. I'll adjust my nozzle. So uh, that's gonna set, we'll let that dwell about two or three minutes. Doesn't take long at all. Uh, well, basically what we'll do is we'll run the whole house since it's such a small house. We'll come back and do some rinsing, but you can see in real time, it's already killing all that. And then we'll just rinse everything off, rinse the shrubbery off. Now I, I know in the comments, somebody's gonna say, oh my God, you're gonna kill all the bushes. No, I'm not. It's, it's about a 1% mix. So this is the stuff you learn when you start doing this is what percentages you need to be at. Um, these bushes, you probably could actually get away with not rinsing them at all, but we're gonna rinse them because that's the right thing to do. But they're pretty hardy and this is pretty weak. So you should be fine if you take those precautions, make sure you rinse everything. We'll hit the windows while we're here, uh, get her to back her car out and get this one taken care of. But you can see just in the time I've been talking, let's hit it with a little bit of water. That's all there is to it. Make sure you wet your glass, rinse all that off. But yeah, easy money, right? So just want to let you guys see that overhang. 